Hi everyone, in this video I'll show you how to use IPPBX system requirements calculator from our company Marion Network. Calculator will show you hardware requirements for a server and required equipment, you just need to enter initial data. So to find out required CPU model and RAM volume, you need to set U parameter, its planned number of PBX users, for example, let's take it for 50. MC parameter is a maximum number of concurrent calls, usually it's chosen as 50% of total user number. So in our case it will be 25. After that we need to calculate storage parameters and we are setting business days of our company. It would be 5 days a week in our case. In ACL field we need to enter average length of one call. We'll take it for 3 minutes. In CPD field it's a call number per day. We'll enter 1000 calls. S field it shows how long call recording must be stored in days. I will store them for one year, so I will enter 365 days here. In bitrate menu, you can state number of bits using to store one second of call, and usually it is 32 kilobits per second. In the field of your ISP connection should be stated line parameters. For example, if you are planning to connect calls only through SIP protocol, click on checkbox only SIP connection. All the fields will be hide automatically. In case when you will connect to your service provider through one channel, copper lines or GSM network, mark one of the checkboxes. It depends on type of equipment used. There might be PCI or PCI Express extension cards on your server or VoIP gateway, which is independent network equipment unit connected to your asterisk server through IP protocol. Let's assume that we have two E1 channels. 5 FXO copy lines and 1 GSM channel and we'll use gateways. So in stream numbers we'll choose 2, in FXO field we'll choose 8 and 1 GSM. Please note that in this case you need to choose FXO gateway with 8 ports as it has required number of ports. In field connection to operator we'll choose 1. Next, we are moving to analog phones connection. Here, we are stating number of old phones used in the office, and uh, all old analog phones are connected through FXS interfaces. So, here we enter two phones. Uh, please note that all fields should be fulfilled, uh, and in other case, you'll see an error. Also, we want to be sure that you are not a robot, so please mark I'm not a robot checkbox and click calculate this error button. After that you need uh, to wait a few moments till application will show you the results. Recommend to send them to your email by clicking the button. So now system requirements of your future IPPBX are on your email and you can start preparation process. Please subscribe to our channel and thank you for viewing. Bye!